Hey, welcome back. It's me, Britt Reacts, and today we are reacting to Randy Travis and John Anderson digging up bones. This is live at the Grand Opry, I believe. Let's see. 25 year Opry member, Randy Travis. 25 years. Last night I dug your picture out in our old dresser drawer. Set it on the table, Ooh. and I talked to it till four. Oh, I read some old love letters oh. until the break of dawn. Yeah, I've been sitting alone digging up bones. These two, their voices belong together. I almost didn't like I had looked down or away or something and didn't realize John was singing. Not now, like not to say they sound exactly the same, but the tone. That good old wholesome hearty country tone they both possess that I love this it's like you want that old thing back you know you, you, you digging up bones I love it I went through the jewelry and I found our wedding rings oh, the jewelry. put mine on my finger and I gave yours a fling across this lonesome bedroom of our recent broken home and a night I'm sitting alone digging up bones. I'm digging up bones. I'm digging up bones. It's so simple. I'm digging up bones. things that's better left alone. I'm resurrecting memories of a love that's dead and gone. Yet a night I'm sitting alone digging up bones. I'm resurrecting memories of a love that's dead and gone. Ooh. Ooh, that's that's sad and deep and true, isn't it? We, uh, we, a lot of us have probably been there, don't you think? <sighs> the shoulda, coulda, wouldas will always take you out every time. I, I always say steer clear the shouldas, the couldas, and the wouldas because they ain't. How about that? They just ain't. So don't try to revisit. Look ahead, my friends. Look ahead. <laughs> I love this song, though. And I went through the closet and I found some things in there like that pretty negligee that I bought you to wear not the lingerie and I recall how good you the lingerie each time you had it on oh yeah tonight I'm sitting alone digging up bones I went through the kitchen to get a bite to eat I just kept on wishing I could taste your kisses sweet. Oh, I found an old coat this is not nice. I don't be sad. Come on and back I'm to him, girl. I'm digging up bones. I'm digging up bones. I'm digging up bones. Too many things that's better left alone. This is, you know, like. I see a lot of you often comment when I react to certain country music and you're like, this is not country music. This is country music. And I completely understand. I, I understand. I think a good way to, you know, make it really plain is, for example, with Beyonce's upcoming release. Um, and she has come out and said, this is not a country. I'll miss a Beyonce album. Like she isn't trying to be anything that Beyonce is not. And Beyonce uh, made that very clear. She's also got many endorsements from the country community. But I understand people wanting to hold, tr hold tight the true form, the original genre of country. It holds much history and culture for a lot of people and so I understand I think with a lot of genres like I, for me you know it's hard for me to listen to like rap these days I'm just like it's garbage you know rap didn't start off that way um well you know maybe some people think it did but for me I, I rap R&B it's all changed um and evolved into something that it wasn't in the beginning and I get I get people wanting to hold on to it and not wanting it to be diluted or 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 polluted or oversaturated or any of the things because music means so much to so many people. Um, and so, you know, I say all that to say like this is country. This it's a story, it's a sound, it's a feel, it's a it's a 
it's a, oh man, what's the word I'm looking for, y'all? It's, um, it's like a home feeling, a home base feeling, you know, it doesn't feel, um, it doesn't feel like it's been compromised, if that makes any sense. So yeah, I love it. I'm resurrecting memories of a love that's dead and gone. Yeah, tonight I'm sitting alone, digging up bones. Exhuming things? These SAT words. got a really great smile oh i love randy travis man and that was an introduction to me of to john anderson i never heard of him or seen him or or any of the, the, the things the things um when you can use a big old word like i'm exhuming in a song and it doesn't sound wordy or heavy you got a good thing there like what that's that's a whole sat word do the kids still take that test? Is that still a thing? Let me know. Anywho, go and have the day you deserve. Bye.